Hey guys, um, another video for today. This is going to be a video more on the, um, or it's going to be a video about a Cydia um, application, kind of back to what I was doing before, which I kind of enjoy doing more because it's more out there. Um, uh, this is a going to be a video about Updater. You can see it spelled just like that. And um, first I want to thank Chamalism, Shamalisms. Um, I'll have a link in the video description to his account, but um, he kind of sent me my first like, oh man, you're awesome mail, so that was pretty cool to see. Um, he also gave me some good ideas, and I'll be going through there to see what I can, um, see some videos I can do out of there, because he requested them, or said I, maybe I could could do some videos here. So I was thinking, and I was like, okay, sure. And so if you have any videos that you want to see me do, just send me a PM and I'll check them out. I'm almost going to guarantee you that I didn't do it, unless it's like, um, I physically, like, can't do it, like, um, my why, which is one of the ones he requested, I, I mean, I'll i try to do, uh, I'll try to get some info in there, here and there, which is the iPhone Wi-Fi thing, which works awesome, by the way, um, I'll try to get s some information here and there, but I can't actually do it, because I only have an iPod Touch, but anyway, let's get to the real point here, and the real point is called Updater, it's this icon right here, and basically it's an app, like, it doesn't physically update your apps for you, but it's telling you if they need to be updated, which is cool to know because then, um, as you probably experienced, the App Store doesn't sometimes doesn't like show all your updates, and this will kind of get all the information from App Tracker, which is a good website for viewing apps and stuff like that. It also another good feature of it is it uses. Um, it can, you can enable cracked apps on there too, so you can know if you need to update your cracked apps, which is pretty important for some people. But I'm, I'm not really into that whole cracked apps thing, since it is illegal, but, you know, if you, that's what you like, then I guess so. So, basically you're gonna, um, when you click the refresh button, you're gonna get a version information, or complete database. Complete database is probably the one that's going to give you everything and version information is just the version stuff. So I'm just going to do version information and okay, I'm going to try a complete database then. Or not. Um, I just got this right now so I'm still kind of playing around with it but let's, I'll kind of kind of explain it here and I'll see if I can get that working. Um, so you're going to, you can go into your settings here um, you can enable, here's what the problem, you can enable um, cracked, only cracked, which is important for some people because people, some people like have a ton of cracked apps. I don't as you saw there, but um, and you can have it update on launch, have simultaneous downloads, um, a full kind of set of features here, but then let's try updating here. You can see it's got a cool, nice updating thing over here. Um, kind of like sending a text message for the iPhone, that type of thing. And as you may notice up here, you know, you usually have that kind of like rotating spin thing, progress wheel type thing. Um, I changed mine to a little dot going back and forth. It was part of the iComplete 3 theme, and I just took it over and put it in the World ETA theme. And I was going to try to figure out how to make that, but that looks pretty complicated getting all the size right. And if you look at all the pictures, there's like 25 or so different pictures of it, the little dot moving back and back and forth. So that's a pretty cool one. It works on like everything, like yeah. So um, here we go. It's updated, and um, here it's, it'll show you. Um, it'll give you kind of like this where it's from here, and the version here, and it says it's unknown all, all these. But then um, I, it says I have the new newest version installed for all these. It knows it, and so I can like click on one of these, and it can say um, view on App Tracker, which is the um, a good website to check if to check um, search kind of apps alternate for the App Store. And um, some of it's the stuff it doesn't really know, but um, kind of gives you you know this thing here for typing. You know when you usually download it. City app, you see this. I'm running out of time here. And if it's not in, I just updated, but if it's not installed, it'll have this little box type here and show those. And then when you click out of it here, it'll have a little icon right here. Um, thanks for wa watching. Sorry about the short video. Um, get it from the repo, um, be your iPhone repo. Subscribe and thanks for watching. I'll have information in this video description.